everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to use web browser in C sharp. Okay. So for that, we just need to stretch it as large enough as per required. I'm just enlarging it to this. And now what we need is when in this toolbox you can search for web browser. By default, web browser is here. In the last lecture, I have shown you how to open a link on button click and that link will be open in the default browser and today I'm going to show you how to actually open the link or any website in your C sharp project for that just drag and drop it here web browser and just you actually this is full screen by default and just need to unlock in parent container and just this is unlocked and you can just make the size as per a requirement and after that I want to <coughs> open google.com when this form loads for that we just need to code on this form load event so just double click on this and just go and this dot the name of this web browser will be here you can search it for name and web browser one so we will write web browser one dot navigate navigate to the site where you want to navigate okay so let me write www.google.com and start this project and it will take a bit time and here you can see this google.com is open here in your uh, in your form okay so uh, let me make it quite good <clears throat> now this is how with this default uh, uh, site open now we need to just search for any site we want for that uh, we need a text box where you can write the site or the link where you want to navigate just enlarge it okay and I need one button for that just drag and drop it and change its name to button sorry search and just here here we go so now to make it bit good I'm just using rectangular shaper just this okay so I'm just giving a shape to this form like this So let's start it or and you can see this uh, rectangular shaper is here but it's still opening the default um, default google.com which we have provided there but now what we need whenever we click on the search button the site written here going to uh, open in this web browser for that just double click on search button and this button click event is generated and just copy this code here okay and I want to just navigate this to text box one dot text whatever the text is in there just I want to open it okay so there is no default nothing now so I'm just writing www facebook.com and just click on search and here you can see this Facebook is open now and if you want that when this default uh, when this form loads and some site needs to be open then just copy this and paste it here and just write the default site in this like I'm just writing google.com okay and just start it and here we go this google.com is open by default and you can write www.youtube.com and just click on the search and there yeah, YouTube is here 
okay so that's it for the today's video and thanks for watching please subscribe me